All right, well, hey everybody. It is Friday, August 1st. It's about 9, 10 p.m. here in Thailand. So it's about uh, 10 minutes after 10 in the morning back home. Um, Want to give you an update. Didn't do a blog yesterday because yesterday was really a travel day for us. We, um, we left uh, Mae Hong Song yesterday. Um, caught another little single engine prop plane back to Chiang Mai. Um, it was an awesome flight. Um, smoothest flight we've had here the whole time. We've had a total of seven flights so far. That was actually my favorite. Um, pilot was really great. We landed and found out that he was actually a trainee um, and the Israeli trainer beside him was taking notes on him and stuff. But uh, he did an awesome job as a trainee so was very happy with that one. Um, we then had like a four hour layover in the airport waiting to go from Chiang Mai back to Bangkok. So um, wasn't a really exciting day until we got back to the house uh, about 8 o'clock or so. Um, had to scramble to get some laundry done and uh, we grabbed a quick dinner um, which was a light dinner but at the end we had a bit of a surprise. We had um, Akka fries and Akka fries are fried bamboo worms. Um, we have a great video that we shot. We're going to get put up there for you guys to see us eat the worms. They were a lot of fun. They're a lot better than you might think. They actually weren't bad at all but it made for an exciting evening and a good time. This morning we got up and uh, we had to head out to Pong Silatong Baptist Church church um, to, uh, to spend the weekend here with the Bethany home and the kids there at the orphanage. It's about a four hour drive so it's about going from Martinsburg to Philadelphia a little bit longer. Um, we got here at about 10.30 just in time for the dedication of the Bethany home. It started off a couple years ago with only six kids and now they're up to 23 or so and they've built a brand new building that they dedicated today. Had the mayor come out um, big festivity. Um, got to hear Charlie speak and, and give some history on the, uh, the home itself. And then I uh, had a great lunch. Um, Buck got to hang out and have dinner with the mayor, which was really neat. I think he had a good time doing that. And then we got a little bit of downtime in the afternoon because we weren't supposed to be here so early, but the weather forecast calls us to come in and do the dedication early. So it was really cool. Um, got a little bit of time to sleep, and then we went out to the farm to uh, to watch or to look at the cattle they had there. Um, they have about 28 cattle here. We actually got to, to stand around while they ate grass all around us, and you would not believe how loud cattle can be. Um, they are literally lawnmowers. It was insane to watch, but it was a lot of fun. We got to help herd them back into the gate when it was done. We came back and uh, we had a, a nice dinner. The kids, the kids here are amazing. This has been by far. The, the best day of the whole trip, I think, because all the kids here are just so much fun. I think that, you know, things change whenever no matter where you go, but the kids are universal in how much fun they are. So we had a good time with them at dinner. Then we had a service afterwards. Um, off the cuff, Brian did a sermon that he wasn't planning on doing because it worked out so perfectly. Um, and it was yet again another example of just God, how God uses him in amazing ways. He, he, he came up literally and in 10 minutes put together a sermon that I couldn't have written in, in days, I don't think, and did it in a way that was just amazing. Um, the kids had a good time with it. Buck sang some um, and, and a couple of testimonies were given. It was, a, it was a great, great service. And then afterwards we gave them a bunch of stuff we brought them. Um, they had donuts that we brought. They got t-shirts and games and stuffed animals and just we had a great time. We taught them how to high five which they hadn't done before and uh, really had a blast. So I think we all got energized tonight um, with, with the time with the kids. Tomorrow we're doing a day camp and uh, we're looking forward to that. So we'll give you an update after the day camp but uh, having a blast here and we'll catch up with you soon. Bye.